Hello everyone, today I'm making broccoli and cheddar soup. Okay, first of all about a tablespoon or so of olive oil in my uh, saucepan, but you can use a little butter as well. So I'm going to add half an onion finely chopped. Uh, one clove of garlic, minced, can you see, I'm just bring it closer, Just sweep this down for a little bit okay now I'm gonna add one large carrot that I just grated I'm gonna add lots of black pepper I'm not gonna add any salt I'll only add salt right at the end. I'll taste because I'm using um, half a liter of chicken stock that has salt in. And for my preference, I'm going to add from my own chicken braai spice that has salt in already. But you can add um, mustard in here. You can add your salt, your pepper. You can add thyme. Um, it's entirely up to you. Also gonna add some paprika to your taste, and this is just one head of broccoli that I just chopped up into pieces. I'm gonna give this a quick sizzle and fry. Add a bit of my chicken dry, about a teaspoon or half a teaspoon. I'm going to let this go for a few minutes. Okay, now I'm going to add my half a liter of chicken stock. Okay, now I'm gonna make add a cup of milk and about two to three tablespoons of corn flour and I'm gonna mix it through cold milk. That's gonna be added in here and then also a cup of fresh cream and then of course the last ingredient would be the cheddar cheese. Okay, I'm gonna use two to three tablespoons of this Mazina corn flour mixed in a cup of milk now depending on how thick or thin you want it if it's too thick add more water if it's too thin add a little bit more corn flour with co uh, with cold milk and then stir it in okay let me just check this out i don't want to overcook the broccoli okay i'm almost ready for the other ingredients let me just Put the corn flour in the milk and add it. Um, this is the I made my creamy chicken corn soup, and this is what I add a tablespoon or two of this. And like I always say, don't add any salt until the end. Taste it if you need any salt because many of these ingredients have salt in already. So if you want to add from this in the broccoli soup as well, you can do so. Just adds a different, a nice flavor to it um, if you want just extra flavor. Now I'm going to add my milk. My 
my fresh cream. If you don't have fresh cream, just add milk. Don't worry about it. A bit more black pepper. bit of cheddar cheese oyster look at that if you want your um, broccoli to have still a bite you can stop the cooking now if you want your broccoli to be a bit softer you can just let it go for a few more minutes and then your soup is done look at that <laughs> I was going to let it simmer for five minutes and then I'll see how thick it gets if I need to add any more milk or salt or pepper. Okay guys, the soup has thickened nicely. Look at that. There's over enough. I didn't need to add any salt. Look at that. Yummy in my tummy. Okay, and now I'm going to dish up. Mm -hmm. This is my plate, my bowl, and my spoonie. What am I don't miss? Da musik. Yeah, da is ikke. Auf ein Moss. Bit of paprika. There it is, guys. My broccoli and cheddar soup. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll be back again with another video soon. Bye, everyone.